Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to create account on AWS for using free tier services. So let's start the video. Before showing you actual steps for account creation, let me tell you what is AWS. AWS stands for Amazon Web Services and it is one of the world's most popular cloud platform. It provides around 200 services. In that services, it includes different infrastructure such as computing, storage, databases, technologies and so many services are available. I'm going to show you uh, free tier services like in free tier you will be having certain services free for 12 months or one year so you can utilize that services so let me show you the steps so you can go to uh, google and you can just type amazon aws and here you can see the official website that is aws.amazon.com just click on this link it has redirected me to official page and here you can see uh, there is option for sign up, no direct option available for sign up. If you click on the sign in button, you will be getting option for sign in as well as sign up. So let me click on this button. And now here it is asking me sign in. If you are already having account, you can directly sign in. Or if you want to create a new account, you have to click on create a new AWS account. So I'm going to show you how to create AWS account. So just click on this button. Okay, it has redirected me to this page and this is the sign up page. You have to enter the email address and this is the root email address and here you have to enter the account name. So this account name you can use for login or even uh, the email address also can be used for login. So let me just enter my email address. So you have to keep your credit card ready because somewhere we need credit card for setting up this account. So I just entered my email address and here I'm going to enter the account name. So this is my account name and then I need to click on verify email address. Okay, so the verification code is sent on my email ID. So I have to just uh, type that verification code over here. Okay, so this is my verification code. I'm just copying and let me see whether it allows me to paste. Yes, it has allowed me. So I'm just going to click on verify. So this step was for verifying your email ID, whether your email ID is working or not. Now here you need to set your root password. Okay, so I need to confirm the password. So this is done. Total five steps we are having. So I'll click on continue. Okay, so after setting up email addresses and password, now this page is uh, showing us like what are the services will be offered in free tire. So we will be getting 12 month free services. Okay, so and here it is asking me uh, whether you want for business purpose or for personal. So I'm going to just check personal. You need to provide your basic details like your full name, your country, your address, city, state and postal code. Most of the fields are uh, mandatory so you need to provide it and uh, after that you need to check mark this and click on continue button. So let me complete this. Part. Okay so after providing detail I'm just going to click on this continue button. Okay, now here it is showing me the billing info. So here we need to provide the credit card detail or debit card detail. Two rupees will be deducted. Uh, rupees, uh, if you are Indian, will be deducted from your account. And after verification of your account, that will be again credited back. Okay, so just provide all the details. You need to provide your basic credit card details. That is credit or debit card number, expiration date, card holder name, CV. If you want to provide a new billing detail, you can select use a new or you can select this option. Whatever you have entered in your previous page, it is going to select that. Asking me, do you have PAN? If you select yes, then it will ask you PAN number. If you select no, it will not ask. Later on, you can go to billing information and you can enter. And after filling all the details, you need to click on verify and continue. So let me fill out my details. So I have entered my details and here I'm going to click on verify and continue. Okay, so it is setting up the payment. So my two rupees will be deducted. It has sent me OTP. So I need to just enter my OTP. 
okay and then click on your submit button okay here we have to confirm our identity so for that we need to select our country and we need to provide mobile number and you need to re-enter the character which is shown over here and you need to click on send sms button so let me do all this thing after entering my detail i'm clicking on send sms button okay so the sms is sent on my mobile now i need to enter the uh, code which i have received so i'm just entering the code okay and then we need to click on this continue button okay on this page it is showing me the different plans available on aws so we have a basic support which is free for free tire and then we have a, a developer support and business support so if you want you can select that i'm just showing the basic uh the free one if you are just starting with uh, AWS, you can use the free tire services for one year. And now let me click on this complete sign up button. So my sign up will get completed. Okay, so my sign up is done. It is showing me congratulation message. Also, it is showing me that uh, we are activating your account. So it will take a while and it, they will send email to us as soon as the account is activated. So what you can do, just click on this go to AWS management console. Here I need to personalize. This is option. If you want, you can select. So just select. So I'm taking IT administrator or we can take even academic or researcher. No problem. And then here you can select the area. So I'm selecting DevOps and then I'm going to click on submit button. Okay, so now here we need to click on sign into the console. Before that, let me just go to my mailbox and check it out whether I have received mail from AWS or not. Okay, so yeah, I have received the email. So you can see they are showing uh, welcome to AWS. Thank you message and uh, everything is ready for uh, free tire. So now you can click on getting started resource or you can go to this part and you can sign in. So let me just click on getting started resources. So again, it will take me to sign in page only. So let's sign in. So here I'm taking root. After signing in, you can create I am user. Let me just enter my email ID, which I have used while sign up. And now I'm going to click on next button. So let me enter my password. Okay. Okay. My login is successful. This is Amazon console homepage. And here we have a services option. If you want to view all the services, you can just click on all services. So here we have different services available. Alphabetically, they have arranged depending on your requirement. You can use. Basically, I'm going to show you creation of EC2 instances. We have other computing instances also like uh, Lambda we are having. And I will also show in my further video databases. So different databases which are available on free tire. We can set up that and we can use that. All right, guys. So uh, creation and setup of AWS account is done. In my further video, I will be showing you uh, how to create instances uh, in free tire. So I hope you enjoyed watching my video. If yes, then don't forget to hit on like button. And if you have any kind of query, you can put in comment box. I will try to reply to your queries. And guys, if you are new to my channel, do subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to press bell icon for receiving notifications from my channel. And if you are visiting my channel first time, please go to my channel. There are so many videos available. You can just explore it. Thank you guys for watching my video till end. I'll see you in my next video. Till that, bye-bye and take care.